intricate device. Shut your fucking mouth! I think someone is coming. Robocop! I knew our founder would send his best! <clears throat> We're not done yet. Mr. Becker, you're, you're still alive! I only played dead so I didn't end up like you, with a bomb strapped to my body. Robocop, you have to defuse it. The explosion could cause the company enormous losses. I need the support of a combat engineer. I saw that Orpheus kid playing puzzle games on his brakes. Ask him for help. I'll be watching you, from a safe distance. Officer Washington, I am looking at a ticking bomb. A, a bomb? Okay, uh, I'm passing you through to the bomb squad. There is no time. I will need your help to defuse it. Gosh, I mean, I, I'll do my best, but, but just give me a moment. First aid, kidnapping... Are you looking for a bomb defusing chapter in the police manual? Found it. First rule, call qualified personnel. Oh, no. Okay, tell me what you see. It is a C4 explosive and seems to be homemade. Yeah, that's what I'd expect from the street vultures. Four cables, green, two reds, and blue. Four cables? Got it. Four connectors with different voltage. What's the highest voltage? 24 volts. Cables lead to the fuse. Does the fuse appear to be electronic? Affirmative. Okay, so they used this kind of bomb before. According to the diagram, you should detach three cables. Start from the one with the highest voltage, then proceed down one at a time to the one with the lowest voltage. There are two different color 12 volt cables. Which one do I detach first? Uh, okay, maybe this isn't the time, but I'm colorblind. I will have to improvise. Just remember, detach the one with the highest voltage first, then proceed down to the lowest voltage. was just a minor incident. Ready to get back to business? Cause I need to make a withdrawal. Like now. Well, I should really check upstairs. Nonsense. This is OCP. Money comes first. <sighs> now, open the vault. Th there you go, sir. Great. Now out of my way. What the hell is this? Where is all the money? Our founder has most of our capital tied up in a very ambitious and resource-heavy project. 
<sighs> I can't believe old man's blowing all of OCP's money on Delta City. Have some respect, young man. Tunnels? Back with the money in the next... We're leaving. You should be proud to work for such a great man. At this rate, soon there might be no one left to work for him. See what I'm talking about? I am in pursuit of the remaining bikers. I have followed them into a tunnel. So that's how they must have gotten here in the first place. It seems they're retreating into the old industrial area. That must be where they've hidden their getaway vehicle. You gotta hurry.
I am listening, creep. Robocop! Why did Wendell Antonowski send you here? This was a suicide mission. We no longer deal with that arrogant prick. We had an agreement. We held our end of it. And apparently it slipped his mind to pay us for our services. Well, that didn't sit well with us. So now we're out to get what we're owed. The only thing you are owed is a prison cell. Yeah, I don't think so. I'm a vulture. I need my space. I'll see you around, cop. Murphy on our team. I have pertinent information regarding the case. We'll get to that, Murphy. But right now, it's time for your psych evaluation. Becker will chew my ear off if I don't make sure you take part in it. So go. Dr. Blanche is already waiting in the observation room. Once it's over, join us in the briefing room. Big idea. Piece of junk taser blew the fuse when I tried to charge it. Robocop, is that you? I can't see anything. I am standing in front of you, Officer O'Neill. Is there a problem? Oh, see, P skimps on everything when it comes to the police fired our maintenance guy to reduce their costs, so now we are literally in the dark. We need to get the power back on. I am equipped to deal with such situations. Follow the cables. They should take you to the fuse box. to build a brand new city where Detroit now stands. Delta City is the only hope that we have. So it wasn't a mistake when they didn't send us insulated gloves. I'm afraid not. Looks like OCP is really I'm ready for you, Robo. Can. God knows what they'll cut next. Or who. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? All right, let's see what's cooking under the hood. Once I'm done, he's all yours, Doctor. Hello, Murphy. Congratulations. I've seen your accomplishment on TV. I hope that I'll manage to remain professional despite sitting opposite a celebrity. How do you feel about being acclaimed as a hero again? It helps if the criminals know that they should fear me. I suppose it makes your job easier. I'm sure you'd love to share this accomplishment with Anne Lewis. You've seen her at the hospital, haven't you? How is she? She is stable. You cherish that relationship, don't you? She's an important part of your life. Your past life, too. She is. Just like your family. You're very protective of your past. OCP cut me off from my family. And how do you view their decision to separate you from them? They would not want to see me like this. Perhaps not. But the alternative isn't much better. 
Nevertheless, you still think about them, don't you? What comes to mind when you try to remember your family? I see. Memories can be painful. Especially when they're connected to the ones you love. They tend to remind us of what we're missing. The thief that broke into my house I mentioned before. He was my brother. He was an addict who'd come over to steal things to sell so he could buy drugs. As you can imagine, my last memory of us together is not a happy one. But despite that, I still wouldn't want to lose it. It serves as a reminder of how I failed him. And I've been trying to rectify it ever since. I do not remember my family. I can only feel them. These feelings, how do they manifest themselves? As echoes of the past. But OCP sees them as obstacles that need to be removed. And now you're afraid that they sent me here to convince you they are right? Did they? What you need to understand is that regardless of outside influences, my client's well-being takes highest priority. Especially now that I understand how important these memories are to you, I will fight for you in every way I know how. If you let me. I think this is a good place to end this session. Thank you for your honesty. It certainly has been noted. I've got plenty to think about for now. <laughs>